there are two very, very special lines that you absolutely have to know. You have to know what they look like, what their equation normally looks like, and what their slope is. If you know those three things about each of these special cases, then this problem and the next one are going to go so quick and easy. But these are things you have to memorize. You have to understand how these things all work together. For instance, <clears throat> here I have a problem that says the slope is 0 and we've got a point of 0, 3. Well, because this slope is 0 here, that should send off warning bells in your head. Because when we have a slope of 0, that's a very specific kind of line. It's a very special kind of line. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to graph the point 0, 3. And then if we have a slope of 0, that means that has to be a horizontal line. Because all horizontal lines have slopes of 0. Now, because it's a horizontal line, it has to come in the form of y equals some number. And in this case, the y value is 3. So if you understand these things about each one of these, then you absolutely will be able to do them. But there again, these are things you just have to know. So it just, you know, get down to it and start memorizing them. Horizontal lines all come in the form of y equals some number, and they are all flat, horizontal, and they have a zero slope. Now the converse to that would be something that looked like this. Here we have an undefined slope and the point 0, negative 2. Well, if our slope is undefined, that again should send off warning bells because there's only one kind of line that, se that has an undefined slope, and that would be a vertical line. So if we're looking at the point 0, negative 2, that would be right there. And if I want to draw a vertical line off of that, that looks just like this. Now every vertical line is named the same way. x equals, and then whatever our x value is, in this case 0. You have to, have to, have to know these. Undefined slopes means that it's a vertical line. If we have a vertical line, that means we have an undefined slope automatically. And the equation is x equals, not y equals.